New Living Paradigm Creation, One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 75. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do-it-yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution-creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for-profit and non-profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 51C3 nonprofit organization. This is our weekly blog update number 75, August 8th, 2014 edition. As always, I'll be covering with pictures and video everything that our team has accomplished in the last week. And if you'd like more details, more specifics, more pictures, uh, links to all of the open source content, you can visit our written blog. Also, if you'd like to receive an email every time one of these uh, updates comes out, send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com. Let's jump into the updates. One community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, a learner, teacher, collaborative, and it includes California state education standards. This week, the core team, which consists of the Satellite and Pioneer members, finished the final 50% of the spring theme lesson plan webpage you see here. It teaches all subjects to all learning levels in the context of the central theme of spring. This lesson plan is the product of four of our team collaborating over the last two months. We also completed the final 40% of the images and descriptions for the English subject page. The sections of the page that you see here are just some of this huge page that is the product of five of our collaborating team and about three months of research and work. If you'd like to help with this education program, we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This week the core team working on highest good food finished adding the diversity details to the Mashua section of the large-scale gardening page. We added the seven you see featured here, plus one more, cultural considerations, planting guidelines, and purchasing details. Mashua is an Andes root vegetable, and the research for these in the complete page that now contains hundreds of rare and heirloom foods is the product of five members of our team and hundreds of hours of work spread over the last several months. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master electrician and a master plumber, if you would like to help out. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This week, the core team working on highest good housing finished measuring and inventorying the rest of the components of the Murphy bed end cabinets for the furniture design for the Earthbag Village domes and dome home crowdfunding campaign coming up. Here you can see them all labeled in preparation for the creation of building instructions. Behind the scenes and related to the crowdfunding campaign, we also finished about 50% of the research and content creation for the open source excavation, foundation, footers, and floor web tutorials. We also finished about 50% of the new open source plaster page formatting of Amir Kassem's research into plasters for the domes. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master plumber and a master electrician. If you or someone you know would like to help with this component of our open source creation process. 
One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This week, the core team completed about 70% of their research into the control systems for the duplicable city center. Picture in the background here is a snapshot of this work that is researching the energy saving and automation systems we'll be including in this structure. We also created a diesel generator macro to identify diesel usage at different energy usages and production levels throughout the year. This is the beginnings of a complete energy phasing in schedule we'll be creating to match the level of detail found in our internet implementation schedule, the soil amendment strategy pages, and many others. Our goal with these huge resources that we're creating is to give people step-by-step -step instructions for remote teacher demonstration, sustainable village, and hub creation. And this macro is helping us identify the most affordable and efficient integration of solar and generators for a completely off-grid living environment that will expand from 50 people to 500 plus people over a period of just a few years. For this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer and a general contractor. The structural engineer is somebody that we're seeking to help us design the cupola so it can be built without a crane, which is very important for our open source goals and duplication anywhere in the world. And the general contractor is needed for assistance in conjunction and collaboration with P2S Engineering, who is helping us with the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing section of this structure. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. This week the core team finished the three new overview images you see here introducing highest good housing, highest good food, and highest good education. This comes with an update of the complete homepage. We also updated our core value of open source page that discusses one community's core value and foundational purpose of open source creation. This comprehensive page covers all our primary open source hubs, the specifics of what and why we are open sourcing what we are, our strategy for becoming the number one provider of open source sustainability information in the world within six months of moving to the property, and more. One community is in the process of new living paradigm creation. And what that means is that we're creating new living paradigms that are really based on empowering people. The way that we want to do this and the way that we're creating is through open source. And what that means is that we are open source and free sharing solutions to all the foundations of a sustainable and self-sufficient civilization. By doing this, we want to put the tools, the resources, the tutorials, and the open source blueprints in the hands of people so that they can build their own houses so that they can create their own self-sufficiency with energy, so that they can create their own self-sufficiency with food, so that they can build their own and operate their own community-based education programs, highest good economics programs, fulfilled living models, as well as true earth stewardship. This is the new living paradigm that we see as possible and as having the potential to positively and permanently transform this planet for everyone. We feel, we know, that if we can make it easy enough, if we can make it affordable enough, and if we can demonstrate the new living paradigm as attractive enough, then the model will spread on its own. And this is why we talk about self-replicating, self-sufficient teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs. The ultimate expression of one community and what one community, the first community, is developing to be is a teacher demonstration hub that people can come and visit experience the new living paradigm, and then take it and go take all the blueprints, all the tools, all the tutorials, all the open source content, all the resources, and go off and create it for themselves. To create another teacher demonstration, community, village, city, or hub somewhere else. And each one of these teacher demonstration, community, villages, cities, and hubs is designed specifically to teach others how to create teacher demonstration, communities, villages, cities, and hubs too. This is why we call it a solution model that creates additional solution creating models. And the more people that join us, the more people that get involved, the more people that help to build these teacher demonstration hubs, the more it contributes open source content to the global collaborative and the global cooperative.
The idea is for the model to grow and expand, to share the new living paradigm, and to create the new living paradigm in a way that is specifically adaptable and malleable to the different needs and values and desires of specific groups and individuals that want to take the different pieces and do it the way that they want to do it. This is what we're up to. This is what we're creating. And we're doing it with the consciousness for the highest good of all. The idea is that if we make it open source, if we free share it, and we make it specifically so it's non-ideological, so that it can be adapted, so that it can be changed, so that different groups and organizations that believe that they can do it better, that want to do it differently, can specifically do that. That is our highest good of all philosophy. Is to be very clear that what we're doing is not the way. It's not the right way. It's not the best way. It's just the best way that we know. And to share it so that other people can do it differently. So if this sounds fun to you, if this sounds exciting to you, if you consider yourself a creator, a maker, an innovator, a philanthropist, a humanitarian, an engineer, an architect of the future, somebody who sees the future as something that we're creating right now, then we invite you to join us. Get involved with our project. Our path is clear. We have created literally hundreds of pages of our website. We have created open source content that can be usable right now in food, in housing, in education, in highest good economics. And we continue to move this engine forward, this engine for change forward. And we're always looking for more people to join our team of elite innovators, creators, people that are doing what we know is possible. Making a change, creating this new living paradigm so that others can participate in it too. So it can be duplicated as a complete teacher demonstration hub or so that every little element that we create can also be duplicated individually. You can go to our food pages right now and buy and access foods that are very difficult to find and grow them in your backyard. You can go to our education pages right now and access lesson plans that have had hundreds of hours put into their creative process. And use those with your kids right now. You don't need a community-based school to do these things. This is what we're doing. And so we just continue to move the process forward. We continue to evolve it. We're always inviting people to participate. Of course, the number one thing that we need right now, one community is still seeking large-scale funding. Or that one person or that group that would like to invest in one community or donate to our 501c3 nonprofit organization and help us get the property off the market. This is the number one thing that can help our project right now. And the reason why is because if we get the property off the market, then it would legitimize our project that much more. But most importantly, it would be allow us to share the location that we have been working around and developing with this location in mind now for over three and a half years. It would allow us to share those details, allow us to take a survey team out onto the property and start working on some of the details that we just can't do until that property is off the market. So if you're somebody who knows people, or if you're somebody that is somebody that can help, we invite you to participate and get involved on the financial end. And of course, we are hugely grateful for all the little donations that we get as well. Everybody that works with one community and everybody that is one community is a nonprofit volunteer. None of us are paid. We're all doing this as volunteer work, and so the donations that we get go 100% towards the operating expenses of maintaining one community and keeping it going as far as our website expenses and little details and things like that, continuing to move the open source content and blueprints and development forward and uh, those details. So thank you to everyone for supporting us. Uh, we're on all of the social media networks. If you'd like to participate in social media, that's a great way to help us out as well. Uh, and just to follow our progress, we are on LinkedIn. We are on Twitter. We are on Facebook. We have a Facebook group, couple Facebook groups, couple Facebook pages. We're also on Tumblr. We are on Reddit. We're on all the different social media networks, Pinterest. So thank you for following us there. Thank you for sharing our information there. Because people ask, what will it take? It really just takes that one person who is really looking for a project, a world-changing, global transformation project like ours, to realize that we have been doing this for a long time and that we have literally put in tens of thousands of development hours into creating amazing things. And we continue to do this, and we continue to report on it every single week with updates like this. So... As always, thank you for following our progress. Uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel, or if you'd like to receive an email every time one of these updates comes out, send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com. And until next week, we will continue this process of new living paradigm creation and uh, continue with arms open wide to invite other people to participate.
So thank you. And we will also, of course, keep on keeping on. Thank you.